Alright, very good. How are we doing tonight? to see me do something really gross. Really yeah. Gross. Yeah. Yeah. All right, all right, good, good response for that. Who wants to see me do something really stupid? Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, you guys, that's great, nice. All right, how about something really dangerous? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, in this red coffin-shaped box, I happen to have an act it's very stupid, gross, and dangerous. Oh, yeah. 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 All right, so for this act, I need a volunteer from the audience. Right here? Uh, let's see, uh, right there, yeah. Oh, oh, right there, yeah. Come on up, come on up. Wow, that was quick. Right, you guys are eager out there. I like it. I like it. Now, come on on the stage there. All right, and uh, what's your name for the audience? How's it going? I'm Chad. Chad! Yeah. Yeah. Say hello to Chad, everyone. Hey, Chad! Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna grab the stool over here. Hold on, I'll be right back. Where oh. is that part of the act? Thanks, Chad. That was, that was all staged. Never met before, I swear. So, Chad. Um, I've got eight objects in this box here. I'm going to show them each to you one at a time. These are my eight objects of danger, stupidity, and grossness. Alright, here we go. Item number one. I've got a pair of scissors. Item number one. Item, item number two. I've got this mean looking hook. Nice thing. Alright. Item number three. I've got a... Ooh, equally serrated, mean, rusty knife. Yeah, all right. <laughs> Item number four, I have pliers. Oh, right. geez, look out. All right. Uh, oh, pliers. All right. Next up, I have a... Uh, uh, I don't know. I think it's for art sewing. something. Sewing. Sewing. But there's a razor on the edge of it. It's mean. Small, but mean. A rotary blade. Okay. Next up, I've got, uh, uh, what are they? They're for, they're doing, doing what? They're sewing scissors. Sewing scissors. All right, all right, this one's just for gags, I guess, but a giant paper clip, hey. All right, last item, last of my eight items of danger, stupid, grossness. Here we go. This is a paper opener. All right, very good. I have eight items here. All right, so Chad, of these eight items, these eight items of stupid, gross danger, I need you to, need you to choose four of these items, just four of these items. All right, go ahead and choose any of the four. Oh, all right. We've got the mean looking knife, the big serrated knife. That's item number one. Those are dangerous. Clippers, maybe not. Oh, oh, the giant paper clip. Very good. All right, that's two items. He's chosen two items. The little man. Mean looking knife thing. All right, that's third item. He really likes the clippers. He's used those before, huh? Uh, no, sir. Oh, sure. Yeah. Oh, yeah. No one in Humboldt uses these. Okay, so we've got the mean looking hook knife, we've got the sewing scissors, the uh, giant paper clip, and the mean looking shredded knife. Thank you, Chad. I'm now going to take these four items and remove them from the other four, from the eight. So. So that leaves me with four items remaining. I've got the scissors, the sewing razor on a wheel thing, I've got the paper opener, the letter opener, and pliers. So, Chad, I've got four items remaining. The choice is up to you, completely up to you. Uh, I've never met you before, you've never seen these objects before. I want you to make a choice. The choice is completely up to you. One of these four objects, which one's it going to be? All right, the, the razor blade on wheel thing. All right, I'm now going to take that razor blade on wheel thing and remove it from the rest of the objects. And that, this leaves me with three remaining objects. Three objects there. Okay, let's see. You, sir, and the checkers in the front. I've got three objects here. If you could maybe uh, clearly identify one of the three. 
The letter opener. Thank you. Thank you. Remember, an audience member, completely random person, never met him. He chose the letter opener. I'm now going to remove the letter opener from the rest of the objects. That leaves me with only two objects left. Only two. Now, Chad, the choice is completely up to you. We've re removed six of the objects. I've never met you before. These are random objects. You've never seen them before. You, the choice is completely up to you. We have only two left. Which of these two objects do you want to choose? With the pliers. I am now going to remove the pliers from the objects. This leaves me with one item. Only one item. This item was chosen at random. I've never met Chad. Thank you, Chad, for choosing this random scissors. It could have been any of these, any one of these eight objects, but I chose the scissors. Now, some of the people out there may have seen me do a similar act. It's called the blockhead act, where I take a nail and I hammer it into my head. Has anyone out there seen me do that? Yeah, I haven't seen anyone else do that. So what I'm going to do is attempt to drive these scissors into my nose. It could have been one, any of these mean, nasty objects, but it was the scissors. We're going to give it a try. We're going to see if I can do it. These are real working scissors chosen at random by Chad. I'm now going to attempt to stick them into my head. This is for the finale, folks. The finale for the big one. Right, here we go. Thank you, Chad. All right, here we go. Inserting the scissors into my head. Hang on, hang on, let me clear out the password. Alright, here we go. Move up the scissors. Alright, here we go. The scissors in the nose. the show, I'd like everyone to raise your right hand <laughs> and reach into your back pocket, pull out your wallet, take out five dollars, get ready to put it in the hat. Alright, now Chad, this is the last part of the show, this one's for the big huge applause. Chad, I need you to do me a favor. That, oh, come on, he can do it. Come on, give him a round of applause for this first. Right back, you can do it. It won't hurt you. Right, go ahead. Just pull it straight back. You got it. Don't so push. Ah! <laughs> Thank you, Chad. And if you look closely, there's a little present on the end. Thank you, Chad. You can go back to your seat. Thank you. Thank you. Once again, my name is Shay Free Love Intercontinental Super Clown. Thank you for watching the Benbo Adult Show on the Kids Stage. Thank you. Thank you.